Hey, what's up everybody? Chris here, and today is a super exciting day. All the way from the United Kingdom is a jacket that I've ordered. So, I've wanted this for a long time. Uh, this is uh, from Wested Leather. It is a Raiders of the Lost Ark uh, jacket, a pre-distressed cowhide leather jacket. So, again, I've wanted to buy one of these for a while, but the cost was always a little bit prohibitive. Like, I, you know, I'm okay spending a little bit of money on clothing here and there, but this jacket, if you look it up on their website, you can see this. It's not secret in any way, shape, or form, but... It's about $275, plus you tack on you know, the international shipping, so you're looking at about 300 bucks, all said and done. So there have been times in the past where I thought about getting this, ultimately did not get it, um, but we got through this holiday season, and I sort of reallocated some funds that would have gone toward a gift from me with the blessing of my spouse uh, to go ahead and pick this up. And actually, my birthday is about a month from now, so it's kind of an early birthday gift also, but I ordered it. It got here super fast, actually. I placed the order, gosh, I don't know last day of December ish, something like that. Um, and it got here just now, this is January 9th. And so I wanted to wait until I was able to record the experience to go ahead and unbox it and kind of give you my impressions of it. Um, I'm sure there are a lot of, you know, unboxing videos and sort of review videos of Wested Leather Jackets out there. If you're not familiar with them, they are the designers who designed the original jacket for Raiders of the Lost Ark, for Harrison Ford specifically. Um, and then also The Last Crusade. I think they did Temple of Doom as well, but I could be wrong about that. And I'm not sure about Crystal Skull and the upcoming Dial of Destiny. However, on their website, they do now have what they call the Destiny Jacket. So I'm assuming they made that one too. I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, I am ready to open this sucker up and see how it fits. And I am going to do it super duper carefully, even though I'm sure it's very durable, highly tough, all of that kind of stuff. So I'm going to just sort of do this cautiously and carefully, but I'm so excited about this. Again, I've always wanted one of these and just didn't feel like I had a justification for dropping the coin on it. But I finally did do that. I finally pulled the trigger on it and I'm very excited. Um, I'm a size 42 and I checked um, the measurements online and it looked like that was gonna line up you know, pretty much exactly where I would be based on every other type of jacket I have. It's a size 42 um, here in the US. So. All right, I think I've got the tape removed from this. Let's see if I can get it open here. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This is <laughs> in a nice bag here. Wested Leather Company, um, British by design. And it's even got a certificate of authenticity that comes with it. This is really awesome. Not that I'm ever planning to resell this, but it's good to have this, it says. This is a certified that this Raiders jacket is an authentic reproduction that has been hand cut based on the original patterns used for Harrison Ford in the film Raiders of the Lost Ark. Signed um, by, I guess, the uh, representative from West of Leather, a dedication from Peter A. Botwright's family for, from the designs he created. West of Leather Company, um, specialist to the TV and leather industry. And I was actually in London this summer. Um, and this is outside of London. It's in a smaller town, I believe, a little bit further away. And I thought about trying to go there, but I think at the time, and I'm not sure if it was a COVID thing kind of lingering, but they weren't really allowing people in the shop. So I just decided to kind of sit on it a little bit and wait, maybe order it from home when I got there. But anyway, it's here. So let's check it out and see. Oh, it feels substantial in a good way, in the best way. It is heavy. Holy moly. Oh, here it is. This is... <laughs> Now, so here's the thing, right? If you look at the jacket in Raiders of the Lost Ark, it's a kind of darker brown color, especially at the beginning of the movie. This is actually, I think the the color of this and the vibe is a little bit more in line with Last Crusade and the way that one looks. And I apologize, my dog's barking in the background downstairs because somebody's walking by with their dog, which poses an imminent threat, obviously. But I wanted a jacket that I could wear on an everyday basis and I just love the style of kind of the more pre-distressed look. And so that's what I went with with this. So let me hold it up so that you can see it. Oh my gosh. And it just smells just delightful, just lovely. So I'm gonna unzip this, all oh, the pockets. This is, this is amazing. This is, this is just one of those things that like I wasn't ever sure that I would actually buy this ever. Got a little motivation to do it. Um, again, as we sort of crept into the holiday season and here we are, so let me go ahead and unzip it. Yeah, it's heavy duty. I love it. So when you open it up, you can see right behind the collar or inside the jacket here, Wested Leather Company, specialist manufacturers to the film and TV industry, British by design, size 42. And you can see the note here, Raiders Jacket by Peter Botwright. This jacket is based on the original pattern as designed and made by me for Harrison Ford in the film Raiders of the Lost Ark. Made in England. Okay. I got to try it on. 
I gotta say, this is <laughs> this is just fantastic. I'm gonna wear this jacket to bed. <laughs> totally joking, but part of me wants to. I'm gonna wear this thing all over the place. Um, it just feels so nice, and the measurements are perfect, right? So uh, when I stood up with it on, you know, the arm length is perfect. The length around the waist is perfect as well. Great pockets in it too, and uh, yeah, I love that it's got. On the side of the pocket, the hand warmers. Yeah, that's nice. So you've got not only the pockets, of course, on the uh, front here, where you can place any number of things. I'm gonna button those because it just sounds and looks great. I don't know what to say. This is this is just this is one of those. Uh, it's really stupid to think about this, but it's just one of those dream purchases that I've thought about for a long time. So real leather. I don't think that I've ever owned a real leather jacket. Definitely some fall leather. I've had that F-A-U-X, some fake leather, but this is the first real one I've had and I'm going to wear it all the time. You know, maybe even during the summer, maybe in North Carolina weather when it's, you know, a hundred degrees, I'll just wear this just for the sake of wearing it because it's amazing. So again, the smell, it just smells so good. Now what I need to research, I think is how to care for a leather jacket, um, a legit leather jacket over the long term. This is just fantastic. It's amazing. So I'll probably have some more thoughts on this as time goes on. And I got to be honest with you, now that I have this, uh, and I'm going to wear it, obviously, as the weather dictates. And it's sort of an everyday jacket. That's why I got this style and this this look with the pre-distressed format. Um, but now I'm kind of thinking I might need a fedora to go with it. Erica, my wife, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I don't know that I'm going to do that right away. But anyway, this is just an amazing jacket. I absolutely love it. If you have a Wested Leather jacket, a Raiders jacket, Last Crusade, any of the other options that are out there, let me know what you think about it down in the comments below, and I'll be back soon.